Israel's invasion deeper into southern Gaza is becoming problematic for the Palestinian population, many of which fled south to avoid the conflict. Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu says Israel will continue until they have obtained open-ended control of security in Gaza. NBC's Ross Sanchez has more. The United Nations is saying today a, quote, hellish scenario is unfolding right now in southern Gaza. You have hundreds of thousands of displaced Palestinians who had fled to the south seeking shelter. And now the south is the scene of some of the most intense fighting as Israeli forces close in around the city of Han Yunus. Israel says Hamas's leaders are hiding in the city, but it is leaving Palestinian civilians with nowhere left to run, they say. They are facing an absolutely agonizing choice. Leaving their homes feels like an enormous leap into the unknown. They simply do not know if they will have a roof over their head if they go south, whether they will have food, whether they'll have water. The UN is saying the healthcare system, having already collapsed in the north, is now on the brink of collapse in the south. The Secretary General of the United Nations saying we are simply unable to reach those in need. Just a fraction of the aid trucks that were getting in last week are now getting into Gaza, and it is contributing to shortages of the absolute basics, food, medicine, and water. Raf Sanchez, NBC News, Tel Aviv.